friends and uh, viewers and thank God that this is uh, Geoffrey Gumba Chiu. Uh, this far he has been a Veneza and I'm happy uh, because he has protected me and kept me alive. And I, I was just a short video to thank uh, my friends uh, who stood uh, by me that time that I was unwell. Those who watched uh, Farodi Wathayo in uh, December, I was so down, I was so low, but I've uh, been on medication, especially the tuberculosis, the TB medication, uh, which are supposed to go for six months. I'm remaining with two months, but you can just see from the video, even uh, the way it even the appearance. I really thank God for you people that have stood by me from that time the support that she gave me yeah i can't complain so having this strength i believe that god has also kept you well because you can't serve god and uh, and uh, struggle that long there is a time that is coming that god is coming to remember all of us in whatever little that we do he is gonna remember us remember he is a faithful god and he always sees everything that we do so I appreciate all my friends, the ones that have been doing follow-ups. I thank uh, Farodi for connecting me to, to those who supported, to those we always uh, communicate with even right now. Just even just calling, checking on me. I really appreciate I've got the moms that have called, have always been calling and checking on how I'm doing. So I'm really happy for you and I believe that we will go far. So as I was talking in the first video, I was talking about uh, what I do, my writing, online project management, and I also did some training, a diploma in counseling psychology. Before I got down, I used to deal with young people living in this IV young people in drug addiction i've always been doing that mentorship before but you know that uh, the ngos the non-governmental organizations have always been supported by the donors but since the start of corona there's not that much fun so donor funding really went down and most of the people who are working in ngos were laid off some consultancy work like mine are no longer there so after going through all those uh, suffering since childhood and the, or the worst was uh, last year i decided to come up with an online channel because i know people face myriad of challenges so many challenges which are tougher than even sicknesses so I just wanted to start a YouTube channel to encourage them through the word of God because I've done motivational speaking but I want to do it in a different way because motivational without putting the word of God in it is not working. So my motivational speaking will be focusing so much on biblical teachings in our faith because if we don't have faith we can't make it. And I really know that it's my faith that I had that time, even before, since childhood, I knew that despite all the diseases that I've had since birth, God has a purpose for my life. And in Jeremiah 29, 11, as he said that he has good plans for us, I believe so. But the Bible is just a living word if we believe and have faith in it. So I want to start uh, online counseling because with Corona people are going through a lot of stress, a lot of anxiety, a lot of depression. Be having a skills on those and having life's experience on what God has done and what a uh, sacrifice can do to a person. I really feel that I'm a testimony and that through my story it can encourage many and through the skills that I have I can reach many because uh, we are in a world that people think that uh, finances is everything. I remember what brought me down so much was that uh, stress, losing a job, losing a wife, 
being uh, growing up as an orphan a lot of issues so there are so many who just need to be talked to people just need to be loved but uh, many a times we get ourselves so busy looking for our daily bread and even forgetting about our social responsibilities as human beings so i thank god for giving me this chance and i'll be motivating people online i'll continue visiting uh, children's home the way i used to do the rescue centers and what have you but with the corona there's a lot of limitations so i'm just uh, recording to for you to see how i have improved and uh, to update you on how i am doing right now when i was starting i was taking like 40 tablets per day but right now believe you me i'm taking only yeah there are six of them plus the syrups for appetite because my eating is not that good but I know it will improve. When the devil is a liar, those days that there was no food, I had appetite, but the food was not there. But when now the food is there, you don't have an appetite. So I know it will increase. So right now it is just like six tablets in a day from 40 tablets, from 38 kgs by December to 60 kgs. That is a, a, a good thing, but it is not by my strength is by the strength of the Almighty God. So those who stood by me, I'm okay. I'm doing well. I thank God for you. He started this journey and he will complete it. That is the faith I have because even the writing jobs that are always there, things have really changed with Corona. They are still not there. So the only thing I, I can do right now is maybe to do, not to be lonely like being in this house alone so not to be lonely i'm one person who like when people improve so when people are uh, helped i get so happy that has been always my goal that one day i'll try to help people my fellow young ones where i'm capable of helping so i'll really urge you to communicate to me my number is still the same we can talk you can give an advice because uh, you are the parents that I count on. There, there is no any, not to lie, there is no any other person that I can ask for an advice. We have different skills, we have different exposure. So before I started, uh, I started uh, my video YouTube channel uh, training and sessions, I'd like your input. Just if you watch this, just call me through WhatsApp. I, WhatsApp is uh, easier. And we'll talk more about that. So I'm recording using my phone right now. But I believe you love the camera, I love the tripod, because I'm in the house alone. Getting someone to record me might not be easy at the times. Because the topics I want to be discussing is about life skills for young people, positive life skills for young people. And our faith, how can we build our faith as Christians? We are 90% of Christians but we are going through a lot of sufferings. So I want to be doing Bible teachings, counseling for those who have tough issues. I have those skills, but mine is a bit different because I link it to the word of God. So feel free to call me. One, one uh, rule in a psychology or in counseling is conf confidentiality. That is what I've always believed in because I've shared with so many people I've done this work before, counseling people, and anything I talk to you remains confidential, as the guideline tells me, and as personally I believe that confidentiality is thing that can uh, help when you do something to your neighbor or to your friend, you don't go sharing with everyone. So. Don't get worried, just need uh, to package myself and start the YouTube channel as soon as next week because I have to do a continuous thing. So I can't hurry up in making that. I have to have time relax and arrange my topics because I have to do it in a way that it is impactful to the people who will be viewing it. So I don't have much right now, but once again, Thank you all. I can't mention the name. There are just a few people like uh, Rachel. I can mention Ruth, Sarah, Simon. There, there, 
there are those I don't want to mention everyone but even if I don't mention we talk through the phone and know that whatever you did always you in my prayers and always God's favor will be upon you each and every time be blessed get in touch and I appreciate everything thank you all